Hello everyone, welcome to Trail Tracker and welcome to Soda Bag, which you can't see because the trees are in the way. So we travelled a little bit further from home today, about two and a half hours, and we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to swap our wheels for some skis and have a go at ski biking. So, here are our bikes for the day. They look pretty much like a normal mountain bike, apart from the fact the top tube's really steep, and if you look where the uh, shock is, it's in a very bizarre position. Thankfully, for everyone else, we're not just being let loose on the slopes on our own. Before that happens, we have a course to pass. Oh, it always looks so easy. It's very bizarre, the feeling of not having a break. Also. <laughs> oh, okay. That was a scary bit. I'll try your right to the left. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh god, I hope it's not much longer. That's a killer. My God, am I relieved. That was a proper stress. Okay, here we go. Second lap. Well, hey, and we've got the first crash. <laughs> All right, so this is the next exercise. We're gonna try carving and then add in a drift to the end. Okay, really got to concentrate on leaning the bike. That really helps. So yeah, what have we learned so far? That is like a crash course, my God. Basically, you've got a carved turn and you've got a slide turn and a hockey stop. You can ride stood up or sat down. Not quite sure which works better for me at the moment. I think in general, sat down. Okay. So somehow we passed the course and now he's letting us off on our own. Shove it down. <laughs> Whoa. So I haven't got the hang of this at all. So I am feeling quite stressed at the moment. This is really not easy. Well, I'm holding on to the handlebar so tight. Oh, that is properly strange. And more than anything else, like sitting on a bike and feeling like an absolute beginner again. I mean, you'd think you pick it up. I can ski, I can snowboard, I can bike. Ski bike, something different. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that's the problem. You've got to try and find the gap when no one's around because we are not as much in control as they are. Oh, oh, Christoph! Ich habe das Problem! Wow, that is a scary moment there. T bar just slipped straight out and then got wedged, thankfully, behind my right knee. But whew, I was pretty tense for the rest of that lift, that's for sure. When it's really, really slushy like this, it's actually better. Oh, getting a bit of flow. That's how you're supposed to do it.
Wow, it's amazing how far you can lean this thing. I don't know what to say. It's like nothing I've ever done before. It's just so hard to describe. There's moments when it just feels like you're on a bike, and there's other moments when it's just nothing like that at all. I don't really feel that I've actually mastered a great deal at this point. Go stop somehow. But Martin seems to think it's time for some more advanced lessons. And he's also convinced me that I should try riding stood up rather than sitting down. Oh, that's amazing. Just suddenly clicked with that standing up. Oh my God. It's like a whole new world of ski biking. Just suddenly I've got this feeling for riding stood up. Carving's harder, so you can do the sliding bit better. Can't do it as well as Martin, he's very good. Wow, oh, that's wild. Oh. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. That is amazing. We had a break and I am so glad they persuaded me we should come again because this is the best. <laughs> Right, we're going to try and carve standing up because that's the one thing I'm not doing at the moment. <laughs> Little bit out of control. That's it, press. Oh, there we go, yeah, just gonna slide, slow it down nicely. Oh, it's amazing. You know, if you'd asked me earlier, I would say, yeah, it's all right. If you'd ask me now, I'd say you should definitely go. Make sure you give it a good try. Because all of a sudden, seems to have clicked. <laughs> Couldn't quite keep it going. Probably should have paid more attention to Martin's hey, lesson Mark. on fakies. Oh, great tech. So good if you've got someone to help you. Just told me to put my feet wider on the pegs. It makes such a difference. I can't remember the last time I learned a completely new skill. And that's super satisfying. So if you're a biker and you're going to a ski resort and you've got maybe a week's holiday, don't think that a day ski biking is a day wasted. Morning was hard work. It was like loads of information really early on. But riding we did after the break was just the best. If you want any information about how to hire a ski bike in Soderberg, or perhaps are even interested in buying one of these amazing machines, I'll leave links in the description below. Anyway, as always, in the meantime, thanks for coming along. Stay safe, and I'll see you next time.